Welcome to our first look at the revised edition of one of my favorite games of all time. This is the re-implementation of the now classic 2012 hand management, card drafting, and area influence game, Kemet. Kemet Blood and Sand is Matigo's first ever Kickstarter and is going to deliver a brand new streamlined edition of the multi-award winning 2-5 player epic strategy game. Now there are a number of changes to the series, but before I get into that, if you're not already familiar with Kemet, let me give you a brief synopsis of the game. Kemet is an aggressive, highly confrontational, area influence game where conflict and a heavy amount of player interaction are expected and strategically vital to victory. Each player will represent an Egyptian god, whose tribe will use their limited number of five actions to buy power tiles, upgrade their pyramids, gain resources, recruit new allies into their armies, and most importantly, command their troops in the battle. A game of Kemet is typically played from eight to 10 victory points, which can be accrued through combat, controlling temples and fully developed pyramids, sacrificing to the gods, and wielding very specific magical powers within their armies. The beauty and the allure of the game to me has always been its ability to mix its simple rule set with its deep, complex set of interactions that forces players to constantly make agonizing decisions between what actions to take and how to swiftly gain their victory points without overextending their forces. Most importantly though are the vast amount of asymmetrical combos that can be explored in the game through its monsters and its powerful set of tiles, all of which give an immense amount of player satisfaction when pulled off in very clever ways. Now the general development concepts behind Kemet Blood and Sand were to keep what has always been Kemet's strength by improving and modernizing the game using the best current standards in board games. And to do so, a number of changes have been made to simplify the rules into version 2.0 without downgrading the gameplay, including a new phase structure that has been created to further simplify the flow of the game and limit some of the more complex interactions, such as movement and combat resolution. Also, the game now has an improved setup to allow for a more dynamic early game, including a preset of tiles that can now be used according to very specific player counts. Kemet Blunt Sand also offers a new deck of Divine Intervention cards that focuses on both changing the values of player forces and the action reinforcements that they take, making these cards more frequent, intuitive, and easier to handle throughout the game. Speaking of cards, the game has also fully integrated the Toss Settings expansion's Battle Cards, Onyx Tiles, and Dawn Tokens, now called Veteran Tokens, into the base game with its own set of refined and streamlined rules, adding even more tactical choices for players to explore. Also, many of the power tiles have been tweaked and rebalanced to make them far more intuitive to use. Finally, the game will offer up a variety of new art and a brand new set of miniatures to accentuate the darker thematic side of its more realistic approach, including a newly created game board that has the flexibility to now be used at all player counts. Now, these are just a couple of things coming to Kemet Blood and Sand, which is going to be on Kickstarter very soon. As always, make sure you guys check out the Kickstarter page for all the final details and components and the final set of rules, so check those out if you're interested. If you have any questions at all about the game, make them in the comments below. Ask questions, subscribe to us, follow us on Twitter, and everything else that we do, and we'll catch you guys next time. Hey everyone, if you guys enjoyed this video, please consider dinging the old bell below. That is going to help notify you of new videos that are uploaded to our channel. And as always, give us a like, subscribe to our channel, and please consider watching all of our videos, one of which you can see right here to my left.